Greetings and welcome to the 10th episode in this Pokemon Omicron. Let's play walkthrough. I'm Jonathan. Welcome to Monkey Butler Gaming. Hope you guys are doing awesome today. If of course you missed the last episode, the link for that is down in the description below. And also, don't forget to leave a like on this video and answer the comment question. And of course, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Just a quick update. As you can see, I'm wearing the headset. I haven't worn that in this playthrough. I'm not using the mic on it though, which is what I usually use because I have a new microphone. Which just arrived today. Did a quick test on it before starting this. And it's awesome. It's cool. And it cost like £18, so it's pretty good. Um, as you can see, team. Can't remember if I changed the team in the last episode. But, um. Yeah, we've got Venom on the team. Venom the Nidoran. Which would be very useful. Uh, we are. Yes, of course. I remember what I was going to do. We were going to do this. Because we had to travel all the way over here. Up this way where that was meeting. And I know I said in the last episode I was going to. Uh, we would return there at the beginning of this episode but I forgot to record that bit so we are just going to make our way back through that back through this very annoying route so we can get there oh yeah it's not a ground Pokemon ground type yet Gosh dang it. But hopefully soon. Hopefully soon. <laughs> dang it. And it paralyzed it. It's not cool. Oh, you're joking. You're joking. Ah. Uh, right, do you know what? We are I'll just. I know what we are going to do. They are going to have some items to hold. To have and to hold until deemed necessary that we need to use it. No. No. I'll press it back. And hopefully with this microphone as well the the noise that my computer makes won't be picked up, I'm hoping. Great, now I'm gonna have to go back and oh, you're joking. Ah I should have done this at the start of the episode. I should have been already there straight away, ready at the beginning of the episode. This sucks. Just thrown out there. It sucks. Where are my repels? Yeah. Because I know I do want I think. Uh, no, it'll be fine from here. We can manage from here. Um, well, that wasn't a great start. It's a bit of a bit of an annoying start. Nevertheless, we shall carry on. If only there was a speed up button on this thing. Because apparently you can use, you can get one, but you have to like use a cheat. I'm not willing to do that. All right, let's get some paralyzed paralyzer heals. No, I've just the Pokemon is this way. Ah. We've got some antidotes already, haven't we? Yeah, we're fine for that. We'll get some awakenings as well. 
just to be on the safe side. We've got some ban heals already. No. Get some of those. I'm just going to stock up. Because I want to be prepared for anything. Yep, we've got some escape ropes as well. Why not? How many repels do we have? We got, okay, we've got a couple more. Just to top it up. Uh, how are we doing on the Pokeball status? Just trying not to overdo it really on the... Ten of those as well, just be on the safe side. And of course there's always that. Just a little spending spray here we've got going on. Uh, that's fine. So about 15 of them. Right, no more spending. No more spending. We're done. We're done with the spending. Right, this is where we need to use the repels now. And of course it doesn't work. Seriously, I could have got level 18, but I've got level 14. Dang. Ow, got some in my eye. Hang on. That's not going to do much. Or that. But, yeah, do you know what? We are going to take you on. We're going to use Sharpie because... Oh no, that's a stupid idea. Never mind. It was a crit. Dealing. No. You could at least get a poison on it. At least land a poison. Oh, come on. Oh, that's pretty much doing about the same damage as poison sting now. We'll stick with this poison sting. With the hopes of we will land a, like we can poison it. There we go. Nice try. Oh. Ah. Come on. It's getting annoying. Okay, yeah, I think we're going to have to switch out the Pokemon. Actually, no, we, we can keep him in. He can take the damage. Because that way, it'll just knock itself out by being poisoned. It's fine. It's fine. It'll work. 
and voila. Oh, come on, I just want to escape. Let me escape from this battle. Thank you. I like the fact these did I actually use the repel. Tranquil. I've already got a flying type, thank you, and you're probably not my favourite of the starting flying types that you can get in games. Oh, poop. Fine, Dwayne. Let's use Rock Blast on it, please. Don't stop at two. I should really have started the episode up top. Ah, oh, this is so infuriating. I hate this route. I hate this route so much. Thank you, Dwayne. You took your sweet time. And now we've got a Pokemon down. We don't have any revives. Just can't get revives yet. Uh, so annoying. Right, we're gonna switch you out. Um. Yeah. You want? Yeah. We are gonna put you in front. We were using Repel. Yes, use another gosh darn Repel. Right, we are finally here. Zeus, this has gone on long enough now. Right. I, I know why Team Olympus has taken over the Pokehadron Collider, and let me tell you, you will never succeed. You don't have the time, caller. There will be no danger as long as we can keep you from finding it. Okay. Is that so? I know someone who might disagree with you. Isn't that right? Jonathan. What? Jonathan, did you hear what he just said? He's bluffing, right? If they truly have the time caller, then the world as we know it could be doomed. Are they telling the truth? Please, Jonathan, they can't be. Oh, I knew it. Believe it, Aria. It was a shame that you never cho chose to join us all those years ago. You could have a taste of this. Wahaha! <laughs> Feast your eyes on the almighty Shaman, the legendary Pokemon. Oh, yeah, of course, that's the time caller. No. I would not stand to see another brave Pokemon enslaved. And I will fight against the corruption of strong Pokemon as well. Wait. Cyrus is on our team? Wahaha! I won't fight you today. We got Cyrus and, and N. Oh, of course I can understand N, but Cyrus? Seriously? Seriously? Shaman, clear us a path. We're done evac evacuating Nyasa Town. Let's go to the Pokehadron Collider. See you later. <laughs> this is not good. They found one of the most powerful artifacts known to mankind, and they've already used it to summon a rare and powerful Pokemon. We can still beat them, right? I don't know. I honestly don't know. Jonathan, have you ever met the LEGEND RESEARCHER? He lives in Superior Town, and he researches legendary Pokemon. 
I need you to go see him. He has a book explaining the origins of the universe. Jonathan, you need to know how big a threat this is. That book explains everything. We'll wait for your return. Fine. Wait, what? Thank you. <laughs> oh my goodness, I should have just done that at the beginning of the episode. At the end of last episode. Oh my. Oh, hey there. Sorry about the mess. I have. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I may have gotten a bit distracted. I'm studying this statue. I think it may be of a legendary Pokémon. If you can, you can help, if you want, I've been collecting scriptures and prophecies about legendary Pokémon. My research is in the book on the table. If you want to check it out, maybe you'll find a legendary Pokémon. All right, now we got to read the book. It's the book the professor was talking about. Read what it says. Yeah. In the ancient void, there was nothing. Then, there was an egg. A golden egg. A powerful egg. Inside this egg, there was a beast known as Arceus. Arceus, the original Pokemon. Arceus created the world as we know it. Time, space, and antimatter and creating awe-inspiring awe beasts to guard them. Arceus created life to inhabit the world and then sealed himself away in his own dimension. Before he did this, however, he created a Pokemon to... This book's too burnt to keep reading. Oh, Jonathan. Stop working on my Pokemon! Sorry about the mess. Oh, the professor sent you here? That must mean... Team Olympus found the time caller, right? Yeah. This isn't good. We need to talk. How do I put this? Remember that unknown, unknown you saw in the cave? No. It was pretty powerful, right? No. Imagine that kind of power times a couple billion, and then you have the power of a legendary Pokemon. See? The time caller allows its user to splice the fabric of time and bring something from the past to, to the present. Effectively, it calls a Pokemon from another time. Or oh, they could do that for Arceus, couldn't they? If Team Olympus has that, they could catch every legendary Pokemon ever. Could just Ultra Wormhole hunt in Pokemon Sun and Moon? Ultra Sun and Moon, sorry. Could just do it that way, it's probably a bit easier. And if they, if they, remember how I told you to go visit Wilson in Fianger Town? Wilson is one of the lead scientists at the Pokemon, Pokehedron Collider. <coughs> cool. It's just, they can summon really powerful Pokemon in the Pokehedron Collider if they use the Time Caller. My voice is going. You read the myth of Arceus, right? Yeah, it was in the book. Well, it says Arceus created the universe and then fell into a deep sleep. I would be if I created a universe, I'd be pretty tired. But last year, I asked myself, if Arceus created the world, who maintains it? Who knows? Suddenly, everything began to click in place. Those strange writings nobody could understand. Those weird, weird hieroglyphs. From what I can gather, Arceus created a Pokemon with power to match its own, to watch over the universe in his absence. The scriptures say that this Pokemon can travel through time, bend dimensions, and more. Maybe I'm exaggerating. But can you imagine if such a Pokemon fell into Team Olympus's hands? You better go. Go find the professor and tell him what I told you. Alright, well... Oh, you joke, can you not at least let me go heal my freaking Pokemon first? Unless it's done it automatically. No, it hasn't. Fine. Don't worry. I'm pretty understated if I want to travel with me too. I should talk to Oak. The legend researcher called us and told, told us what he told you. Then why did I have to trek all the way back here then? 
It's very worrying, isn't it? Uh, yeah, just a bit. Your mother went off to Blackfist City over in the Chrome Circle. That giant circular island in the centre of the region. Team Olympus has quarantined Nyasa Town. There's only a few stragglers left and... <laughs> okay, that's... Okay. <laughs> Alright, I'm suddenly realising this may not be suitable for younger audiences. Um, Alright, but we're just going to have to go with it. But I'm just going to say, holy crap, what was that? Because I'm not going to swear. Oh my god. That's what they quarant that's why they quarantined off Nyasa Town. Nyasa Town it's Oh my god. They've destroyed it. I have to go. And Jonathan? I'm sorry. He just dis he just vanished. He didn't walk off or anything, he just vanished. Okay, well I need rock time to scale most of the rocks in the region, but the rocks ahead look scalable. Yeah, we'll carry on using repel. Wait, is this the town? Is this all that's left of the- Is this actually- Seriously, is this the town? Is this- I'm not surprised they introduced swearing into this, because I'd be pretty surprised. And I'd be swearing my head off if, you know, if this happened to a town I was living in. What's in here? Oh, this is where we started off before. There we go. Alright, yeah, this is where exactly where we started before, so. I'm a bit lost as to what I need to do. Or do I need to go into that second cave that was there? This is crazy. Alright, okay, here we go. We are not responsible for what happened in Nyasa Town. Team Olympus took the high road and evacuated the city because we knew you pathetic scientists would mess up. Oh, okay, yeah, we are in the, the Pokehadron Collider place. At least, at least the time caller worked. Deveus, the Traveller has been called from the ancient times. Deveus. Deveus' power. We could move anything through time. Anyone. Any object. I could snap my fingers and you, you would be a wailing baby lying at my feet. Team Olympus would be invincible. Now we only have to catch it. This is a fake mon? You'll never get away with this. Trainer, help us! You, Jonathan. Athena told me all about you. You nearly messed up our plans in Onega Town. That's it. You're going down. Apollo. Uh, Houston? No, 
we have a problem. Team Commander. Okay. Full picks. Alright, immediately that's not good. Smash up straight away. Dwayne. Wow, but that still did quite a lot. Oh my god, I'm so underleveled. Um, oh, good dot. Good miss, good miss. Come on. Yes. Thank you. Sorry, Vulpix. You're a cute Pokemon and all, but you needed to go down. You have a bad trainer. Spins up Soul Rock. Soul rock, soul rock, hang on. Uh, is it is it rock and psychic or is it rock fire type? I can't remember. I know I know it's got rock in there somewhere. It's rock fire or rock psychic. I can't remember which one. Um, soul rock. That's Gen three. Um, Did I just hear machine guns? Soul Rock, come on, where is it? Oh, there we go, 338. It is rocks, Rock Psychic, okay. So we can use a ground type. Oh no, can't use ground tape because it's levitate. We can use water, we can use grass, or we can use steel. Um, or dark type. Okay. Uh, Sharpie, go back in. <clears throat> Sorry about that. That took a bit longer than I thought. Alright. Oh, fire spin. Um, thank goodness that missed. All right, good job. Good job. Um, yeah, we'll bring in Dwayne to finish this off. I am invincible. I'm invincible. You're a loony. Eh? Feel my never ending wrath. Okay, we need to keep our distance. Come on, hang in there, hang in there, Dwayne. Dang it. Okay. Oh, thank goodness I was holding that battery. Um, no. Um, super potion.
damn it. Um. All right, we'll try and bring in Banshee. See if what, what he can do. Come on, Banshee. Thank you. Right, now we're both confused. Now use Thundershock, if you can. Come on, Banshee, hang in there. Damn it, come on. Come on, Banshee. Come on, Banshee. Yes! Good job, Banshee. You hung in there. No! Team Olympus is undefeatable. Impossible. Money. No. Impossible. The Time Caller. I'll use it to revive my Pokemon. Go! Ha 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 ha! You see that puny child? Tremble before our might! Hey! Oh, you're Wilson! Of the Elite Four, the legendary dragon type trainer and Pokemon creator. I didn't know I had such a following here. Now, screw off, Olympian scum! Zeus will hear of this, be sure of it! Well done. At your eight, your young age, defeating a Team, Olymp Team Olympus member is no easy feat. I offer you my congratulations. My name is Wilson. I used to work here in the SC SCP department. SC SCP stands for Synthetically Created Pokemon. After 681 different experiments, I finally came across success. I became one of the greatest trainers in the region. It was lucky we caught that Olympus agent in time. The only reason I actually came here was to find you. My friend, the legendary researcher, told me you'd be here. He told me you were a fantastic trainer. I see now he told the truth. Hold on. I feel as if I know you from somewhere. You look like somebody I used to know. I'm sorry. There's something in my eye. I need you to go to Lado Ladoga Town, over in Chrome Circle. You'll need a Pokemon that knows Surf, though, and you'll need four gym badges to use that. You should challenge the Agazazazaz Gym, City Gym, to the south, and the Fianga City Gym when you're done. I, I should go. Where did all they come from? That was creepy. Um. Oh, good. Alright, that is where we are going to end this episode. Thank you guys so much for joining. If, of course, you enjoyed it, please do leave a like, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and answer the common question down below. And that is all we have for now, for now guys. So until next time, stay tuned, guys.